this is my 200 dollars laptop and i purchased it from the local market and two days in this video i'm gonna show you how you can optimize your laptop for getting the 200 plus fps so guys welcome to my channel if you're first time here please subscribe and don't forget to drop a like on this video and with wasting any time let's dive straight into it so guys in the first step it's most important on your laptop you need a best power plan settings and how you can do it for that you need to open up your window search and search for power settings open up power and sleep settings and go into the additional power settings and then here you need to choose the high performance power plan on your laptop if the bitsum is available on your pc so guys go for it and choose this power plan on your laptop now in the next step we are going to optimize our visuals because that consume our lot of resources on our laptop so for that you need to right click here on your windows start icon and go straight into the systems now go for advanced system settings and go for the performance settings now set it onto the custom and set the settings which is the show shadows under mouse pointer show shadows under windows and show thumbnail instead of icon and then smooth edges of screen font after that hit apply and click ok click ok again and close out your this window settings now in the final and the last step and this is the most important step for your laptop and you need to download this tool on your PC. This is the Windows Deep Load. Help you to optimizing your window settings, disabling the unnecessary services, and cleaning all of the junk data. You can download simply from the description link down there of my this video. Go there and download this tool on your PC. Once you download, now double tap here. And guys, here is the interface of the Quick Boost Early Access. Now I'm going to show you how you can do the best settings. So in the very first step. Here is the general settings and you need to go for the first tab which is the enable exclusive full screen and disable xbox game bar click here on this option and this will apply the settings in just one second or one click then click ok and guys then here is the most important settings for the laptop and that is the disable power saving click on this option and click ok again now here is the time resolution for reducing your input delay on your laptop click here then here is the import quick boost power plan if you want to use the quick boost power plan on your laptop so click on option and this will apply all the settings in your power then here is the disable startup telemetry it's most important for your laptop simply click here then click ok and guys go for the disable mouse acceleration again click ok and here is the apply system profile tweaks click here and click ok again now in the next step guys here we find our disable and assessed system services Disable startup programs and remove pre-installed app. Click here on the disable unnecessary system services. And this will disable all of the unnecessary services from your PC. After that, click OK. And here is the next step, which is disable startup program manually. Go for this option. And then here you will find out the complete list. And you can disable any application which you want to stop on your Windows startup. So right click here and disable this team because I not usually uh, use the stream on my laptop so therefore i'm disabling it after that close out task manager and now let's go for the next step in the next step here is the advanced settings which is the disable power throttling so go for it and disable the power throttling on your pc and okay go for the memory tweaks go for it and this will do all the memory settings for your pc click okay go for the pc edit tweaks for your input delay again and then here is the nvidia highest p state and gpu option i suggest you to simply leave the settings now go for the next step and which is the cleanup in this step here you find out clean temporary files so go for clean all temporary files and this will do everything for you and clean all of the junk data from your pc this will clean your epic games fortnite temporary files and also your windows temporary files so guys this step will take few time so it will take you around one minute according to your laptop so guys after all this now after that now simply close out this application and then you need to one time restart your laptop therefore all the changes will take effect after that launch your fortnite and enjoy the best performance out of it i hope so you love it please make sure to subscribe and share your opinion about this video in the comment section so till at the next video peace out